Lord, that you love us, God. Lord, that just show how much you love us, God. Because you gave us something special, God. And we don't take that for granted, God. But we worship and we praise you, God. And we ask that you continue to strengthen, Lord Jesus. Continue to lift up, Lord Jesus. Lord, continue to keep a hedge of protection, God, around our leaders, Lord Jesus. Lord, even sickness, whatever way they may be trying to come against them, God. Lord, we ask that you would lift them up, Lord Jesus.
which is perfect, control me and flow through me right now. I am a master. God made me a master. And nothing outside of me will I allow to master the power inside of me. It is now done. It is complete. Because of this, every day and in every way, I am richer and richer and richer. I now express life. Eternal life is mine right now. Come on and put those hands together and bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. I need. The oh, I need thee yeah. 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 every yeah. hour. Yeah. I need thee, yeah. Yeah. oh, bless me now, my Savior.
you right now. God, we glorify you right now. God, if it weren't for you, God, what would we be right now, Lord? God, we thank you for bringing from things seen and unseen. God, we thank you right now, God, for a clear state of mind right now. God, we thank you, God, for the peace, God, that's the battle all understanding right now. God, we thank you right now. God, we worship you right now. God, we glorify you. God, we thank you right now. God, for moving, God, on our behalf, Lord. God, we thank you right now, God, for standing in the gap right now, God. God, we thank you right now. God, we came to give you thanks right now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It's something where you can praise God without an organ. It's something where you can praise God without a drum. It's the music in the air, Hoshika. Because God has done so many great things for us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God, we exalt you right now. God, we glorify you right now. Hoshika. Hoshika. God, we glorify you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. We're, we're almost there. If you just let go and let go. Hallelujah, God. Oh, Shabbat. Sometimes you just don't know what to say. Hallelujah, God. Oh, Shabbat to me. Oh, Shabbat to me. God, we worship you, Lord. God, we thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, God. God, we thank you. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah, God. Was the thought that you woke up with this morning? The thought that you woke up with this morning that you needed for him to do. At this moment, at this time, God himself says, I'm getting ready to make a way. I I I I see. Uh, throughout the room that you're heavy, heavy and heavy laden. But God said that thought that has whirled you down up until this moment. God said, I'm getting ready to take care of it right now. Do I have anybody in the room? I told you we almost done already. It don't take all day for God to do what he needs to do. But he said that thought that had your back Oh, it hasn't happened yet, but just to go on my mind has me discombobulated, all distraught. But he said, I'm getting ready to take care of it. Right now. Oh, it won't destroy you, it won't hinder you, it won't frustrate you. At this moment, God is going to take the pain away. Oh, He's taking the pain. He's healing you everywhere that you heard. Oh God, I thank you. We bless God. I said we bless God. God, we thank you for being such a favorable God. Oh God. Oh God. Maybe out there call them different names. But we thank you all for your name, God, is a strong tower. Oh, God, I thank you right now. Oh, God. God, we praise you right now. God, we thank you right now. For this, all your people, 
that has assembled themselves together to worship you, to praise you. We thank you right now, Lord. Hallelujah. 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 I'm I'm trying to move forward, but he said I just need a couple of more minutes. I just need a couple of more minutes. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. 
We thank him just simply for him being God. Amen. We thank God for each and every one of you that makes up this body of believers. Ah, God has been better than good. Yes, he has. Oh, God, that events. He's been better. Yes, he has. God been good. God, we appreciate you right now. We vast in his glory. We vast in his glory. Amen. This moment is not for naught. You did not wake up on this day. Rise and get yourself together. Get in your car. Drive how many miles? Just for you to sit here. But God has a divine plan. Yes, he does. And he's gonna do it for you today. Yes, he will. Hallelujah. God I came with an expectation of God. For God to change my life. Ah, God, I thank you, Lord God. I know I've been here on this earth how many years, but it's a change that has come over. See, not a man sick again, shall die. There's life that there still has to be lived. Oh, God, I thank you right now. God, and I appreciate you right now, God, for giving me the mind and the understanding to know that there's many more miles that I need to go. And I can't leave and I can't go without your help, Lord. God, I thank you right now, Lord. God, we glorify you. We thank God, amen, for our great leader in his absence. Amen. None other than the great apostle, Juan the Lord. Yes, yes he Lord. The doctor himself, yes. the bishop, the apostle. Yes, yes. Amen. We thank God, amen, for the great work that he's doing amen. Amen. in the state of California. Amen. Yes. Uh, we thank God, amen, for all of our mothers and our elders. Yes. Amen. For yes, these Lord. great people that assemble together to thank give God praise. We thank God for all thank of you. We thank God for uh, all of you. Bless you. We thank God for all of you. Ah, God, I thank you right now. God, I thank you. I'm going to get to the word of the Lord. Like I said, I'm not going to be very long. Uh, with what I have to say uh, this morning, uh, but I'm going to say what he gives me to say. Um, but I, I want to take this brief moment, brief moment, amen, because I hear God and I know that God is speaking. Uh, woman of God, woman of God, I need for you to do something for me. Uh, what you do in this next second is going to change not only your life, Amen. but it's going to shake everybody else in the world. There's a scratch that you're going through right now. There's a scratch that you're going through right now. And God himself says, I'm trying to mend you back together. My God, my God. Thank you, Lord. He says, even in the moment of being here this morning, there was a press, there was a scratch for you even to be here this morning. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. But he says, if you just praise me. Yes. And glorify me for the outcome. Yes, yes. Even though right now you're still in the middle of it. Thank you, Jesus. He says, if you just praise me now. He said, if you just praise me now. I'll expedite the end. Oh, 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 
God, we thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I thank you for being the present help in the time of God, I need thee. Yes, I need thee, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes. Oh, bless us. Samuel 16, amen, uh, starting at the first verse. All right. First Samuel 16 and 1 says, And the Lord said unto Samuel, And the Lord said unto Samuel, Who is Samuel? Who is Samuel? Who is Samuel? Anybody can ask, answer that question? He's the prophet He's and the, the priest. priest. He's the prophet and the priest. He's the prophet and and the priest. Very key. Go on. How long wilt thou mourn for Saul? How long wilt thou mourn for Saul? Yes. Who is Saul? We all know this. this is his Sunday school lesson. Yes. Uh, like I said, well, I, <laughs> when he said, I haven't heard that in Sunday school in, in a thousand years. <laughs> yeah, but we're going to go back to Sunday school right now. All right. So who is Saul? Who is Saul? Who is Saul? King of Israel. King of Israel. So the priest is hearing from God, right. mm -hmm. saying to say this to the king of Israel, but in the midst of him saying this to the king of Israel, the priest begins to mourn. Mm -hmm. What mourning means, it means that he begins to become saddened and weeping in his spirit right. about this moment. Right. This moment, it has destroyed him down to a core that he's now emotionally tied right. to what has happened Ooh. in that moment. Right, right. Knowing that I'm the priest. Uh -huh. Knowing that I'm the prophet. Yeah. Oh, God, I thank you, Lord God. Yeah. Like I said, I just want to talk. Tom Bishop. <laughs> Knowing that I'm the priest, I'm the prophet. 
but this moment has hit me that I have come to scrub and I begin to weep. Oh my God. Jesus. God says, say to Saul, the king, go on. Seeing I have rejected him from reigning over Israel. Oh! Uh-oh. Uh-huh. Priest, prophet, hears from God. He's mourning. Saying, say this to Saul, the king. Why is he mourning? Because God has rejected him. That's a bad thing. God has rejected his right. Right, 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 right. God, I thank you, Lord God. Oh, God, let me put it this way. You were able to rise up on the platform that you're on. Okay, come on, Bishop. But now, now. there's a rejection going on. Oh, well God. Done, God. Oh, God. oh, God, I thank you, Lord God. On, there's a rejection that is going on because. Let's go. Come on, fill thine horn with oil and go. I will send thee to Jesse the Bethlehemite, for I have provided me a king among his sons. Huh. You've been rejected. My Lord. But God has already found his replacement. Uh, yes, yes. Oh, God, I thank you, Lord. God, I thank you, Jesus, right now. You've been rejected. The priest, the prophet, has now come to a season to understand that what God has instructed for his kingship, that that king has not done everything that he needed to do uh -huh. right. to protect God's people, uh -huh. to honor God's people, right. to bring God's people out fully. But he says, now I've come to a place because I heard the cries of the people. That's the only way that you're the king now. Uh -huh. But now I need to find somebody who's after my own heart. Oh God, I thank you right now, God. Uh, it's no more to a place that I need gifted people uh -oh. in this position. Okay. I need somebody who has the anointing. Yes. Yes. That's going to be able to bring my people out. Right. Okay, listen, listen. Uh, we talked about uh, uh, the anointing. We talked about the anointing. Right. The Spirit of the Lord of God is upon me. He has anointed me. Right. He has anointed me. And I wanted to dive into that aspect of trying to figure out how that, that place in my life. Okay. Uh, you know, certainly in, in situations of coming into church and, uh, you know, normal basis, you know, all I want to do is come to church. <laughs> yeah. Come on, Bishop. All I want to do is come to church. Hey, come on now. You didn't come to church to be a pastor. No, 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 no. 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 You didn't come to church to be an elder in the church. No. You just came to church because at first somebody invited you. Right. And you needed some change in your life. Right. All right, so in that change in your life, you was like, okay, after I get my change, that's it. Hey, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I don't need to, you know, do anything else. I right. come and get my tithes, get my offering. I don't need to say nothing to nobody else. But there's a service that God has planned for your life. Yeah. All right, come on, Bishop. Yes, yes. So we, we, we come and, and, and we become to a place of being selfish. Well... Mm -hmm. Because we don't want to do anything. We don't want to say anything. Because we got ours. We all are right. all right. Okay. <laughs> Come on, Bishop. But the Lord says, the Spirit of the Lord of God is upon you. Yes, yes. There's a place of elevation and place of maturity that you have to get even after you get yours. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Uh, there's a generation that needs us. There's a people that has not heard of God. That has not heard what you have heard. Uh -huh, okay. But there's a place that God has for you to be able to 
say, okay, uh, I got to come out of this. Yeah. Somebody yeah. needs to hear what God has for me. We overcome yeah. by the yeah. words of our yeah. testimony. Yeah. 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 Come on, Bishop. Encourage yourself was a wonderful song. Right. right. But who else are you encouraging in that moment? Oh, well. All right, come on. We as Christians, as, as believers, amen, we're scrutinized at all points in all areas of our life. Yes. Even right. if we're having a good day or a bad day. Right. But we can't use our bad days as excuses. Come on. Oh, okay. oh God, I thank you, Lord God. Oh, God. Come on, Bishop. It can, it can happen that way. Because the Spirit of the Lord God is upon me. All right. He has anointed me for this service. He didn't know that my leg don't feel good right now. He didn't know that I may have the highest blood pressure. He has anointed me for this moment. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. There's instructions after this. You have to be in a place where you understand your assignment in God. Samuel, the priest, the prophet, Thank God for our priests and our prophets. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Here's from God to tell the king Saul that he needs to destroy, utterly destroy okay. everything. Everything. Mm. There's something when we become so attached to things well. that we become disobedient well, to the voice of God. Obedience will save your life. Yes, it will. He comes to a place of saying, Saul, destroy everything because of what these people have done to me and done to you in the past. Okay. Don't take nothing. Yes. But Saul himself, he says, that looks good. Mm -hmm. That looks well. I can take that. Well. Use it for my glory. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm, God, I thank you, Lord God. We're putting our hands on a lot of stuff that God has told us to remove our hands from. Oh, oh, help us. Help us. Help us. Uh, because we have compassion, because we, we're caring, because we, we, we feel that we can make a change, uh, a difference, we find ourselves going into such a battle that God has not a day. Okay, come on, Bishop. If we keep putting our hands on it, he can't take care of it. That's it. All right, all right. Leave it alone. Leave it alone. God can handle it if you just leave it alone. But we find ourselves trying to fix everything. I think I can fix it. That's true, sir. I think we can do it. I, I, I think I, can, I got it. You're causing yourself more frustration than yes, anything. Yes, yes, If you just right. leave it alone. Leave it alone. Leave it alone. Oh, yeah. If you leave it alone, just go to somebody who knows what they're doing. All right. <laughs> All right. Hey. We always find ourselves in that position. Always. But he says, so, destroy everything. Because of the hindrance of your past. Ha! Huh. Listen! Oh God, I thank you for that one. That was not a hindrance at that moment. Well. That was not a hindrance at that moment that we didn't see. Okay. He says, take care of your past in order for you to be catapulted into your future. Wow. All right. All right. You don't know what's going to go on if you don't take care of this right now. Uh -oh. All right. You're right, right. Because in the future, you got more rivers to cross. Yeah. Well. And you don't want any hindrance. Mm. So take care of it right now. Mm. Takes care of it, but he takes sport. Right. Mm. Then he goes back and talks to the prophet and to the priest. Yeah. Now listen to this. We find ourselves not being truthful and honest. Well. Because it's a place that we still want to make ourselves look like we're overcoming. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The truth shall make 
you flee. But this man knew what he did, understood what he did, and blatantly lied to the prophet and the priest and said, I didn't take nothing. We have to be honest in this season of our life. There's a lot of situations that we don't got ourselves in. Well, hey, come on now. I know I made that choice, but I'm not gonna sit here and lie and say I didn't. I didn't. Yeah, I did it. Right. I, right. I did it. Guilty. I'm guilty. Guilty. Because <laughs> you can't persecute me. Oh God, I thank you right now. Well, I'm just confessing my my faults. Right. Right. Because some of us done did much worse <laughs> stuff than others. Well. <laughs> but I have no heaven to hell to put you in. Well, well. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. Oh, yes, Lord. Come on, talk about a real. But there is a place where I say, I got to be, I got to be real. Right. Right. I got to come before you always. Right. This is me. Yeah. All right. In order for God to get you to where you need to be, you have to come open to Him. Yes. 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 Honest. Yes. yes. You're the king. You have favor and blessings over your life well, that you shouldn't have. That's right. You were not even supposed to be where you are. Amen. But you take a moment to lie to the prophet. He gets to a place because Samuel was the prophet and the priest and understood what he was doing. He comes up slit in his spirit. That's why he begins to mourn. But now I can't stay there as the prophet and the priest. All right. And this is where I'm wanting to go and I'm, I'm done. There's a place in our life right now that God has anointed you and, and has a sign, an assignment of your life. Because hurt, church hurt, whatever it hurt is, how you label it, right. you can't stay there. Ooh. Amen. Uh-oh. Help us, Lord. In this moment of this kingdom medical movement, I, right. thank you, God. Thank you, Lord. Even in this moment of this kingdom medical movement, mm -hmm. I can't allow a monument to hinder me from going to my next place. All right. All right. All right. All right. Because there's a nation, there's a people that needs to hear the goodness of God. Right. Hear that he brought me out. Right. Hear that I had cancer, but he delivered me. Right. Hear that I had high blood pressure, but he brought me out of it. Right. 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 Amen. I can't stay there. Yeah. Right. There's another place. Ooh. Another individual that needs to be anointed. Yes. Right. Right. Ooh, God, I thank you, Lord God. There's another minister Mike out there. Yes. There's another elder Deborah out there. Yes. But because I'm in my feelings. Oh, God. Because I was in the position of anointing this king who disobeyed God. Okay. That's why we have to be so careful who we lay our hands on. Ooh, that's right. You know, that's right. All right, God, I thank you, Lord God. It's all about title and it's all about, you know, status right now that you're laying your hands on people that God has not ordained at that Lord moment. Lord, help us. That was good. That was good. Yeah. Mind you, I, I, I've come to a place that uh, I can't say what type of conversation that you had with God. I can't say that. Right, right. But into the position of God confirming and God uh, affirming to ensure that I'm laying my hand on the right individual. Right, yes. right. Come on, yes, sir. In the right timing. Right, yes, sir. Because if you lay your hands on me before time, I may shipwreck. Right, right. Not only I may shipwreck, I may cause shipwreck to somebody else. Right, right, right. Yes. Come on, Bishop. You're talking good. He 
was in a position of saying, okay, Lord, I know that I'm in that position. God of him says, what you crying for? Well. He didn't do it to you. He did it to me. Right, right, right. He did it to me. That's it. Disobedience can either, well, not either, it, it, it's going to be to position, uh, it, it's consequences. Right. It's consequences to every choice that you make. That's true. Amen. I tell my kids that all the time. That's true. That's true. Even though that I may not have the full options or full understanding, but if somebody give you clear instructions, right. <laughs> go downstairs, put the food in the refrigerator, and close the refrigerator. Right. <laughs> I'll follow behind you. You go downstairs, open the refrigerator. Go in the pantry. Oh, God. Do this, but the refrigerator is still wide open. Lord Jesus. Because you have not followed the full instruction. Right, right. I forgot. I'm sorry. It was a mistake. But I gave you clear instructions. Instruction. Go and kill the Amalekites. Only to destroy them. Don't take nothing. Kill every last one of them. Yes. Don't take nothing. That looked good. Uh -huh. Huh. Think about that. A lot of relationships and things that we get in our in, 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 in ourselves into, that look good. Right, right. right. Yeah, oh Lord. <laughs> no, you don't need that right now. Don't do that right now. Right. Uh -oh. No. Uh -oh. But it looked good. Yeah. <laughs> I just take you know, I'll pay for it later on. Yeah, right. <laughs> I'll take care of it later on. Yeah. Now that later on comes, you all mad and distraught. Right, right. <laughs> Lord help. But he says, and I'm I'm done. I'm done. He gets to a place of talking to, to Samuel. Saul did what he did, okay, fine, good, well done. It was the people's choice, it was not God's choice. Right, right, that's true. Even in that, that position, a lot of people who have placed certain leadership and certain people on these platforms and these pedestals mm -hmm. are now seeing the downfall right. of some of these people. Right. And the Bible says gifts comes without repentance. Right, right. And I understand there's a difference between gifting and the anointing. Right, right. Come on, Bishop. Uh, a lot of people don't fully understand there's a difference between gifting and anointing. Right. Uh, and I, I had to, you know, try to delve into it uh, to give, you know, an explanation. God himself has given a uh, many array of gifts, has given to it. Yes. He just given. You didn't have to do anything. Uh, for that gifting. You right. have to do absolutely nothing. Right. You had to do absolutely nothing, nothing. to get yes. that gifting. But the anointing, the anointing. that destroys the yoke, the yeah. anointing yeah, right. that has come to a place of uh, 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 assigning you to an assignment to break barriers and do things for you uh, and for other people's lives, there's a crushing, there's a place that you had to go through right. to get to that oh, anointing. Right. It was a price for it. Yes, Lord. And in the transition of Saul being king to now Samuel looking for the next king. As the prophet and the priest, now I have to carry the oil, the oil carrier. To ensure that in this next move, the next person that is chosen, they're fully anointed. Yes. With the oil that God has given. Yes, yes. To ensure that they have the power to, in, in, uh, to, to, to make sure that they have the power to uh, complete the assignment yes. that I have given. Uh -huh. 
He goes down to Jesse's house. He's afraid because now he's in a position of, I have a king that did not do what he needed to do and does not understand his position to a place of now I got to anoint somebody else. Right, right, right. And me anointing somebody else, I got to sneak around and, and anoint somebody else. Yes. You know, because yes. you, you, you're you afraid now. You Because you messed up. You right, know. right. You messed up. You took yourself out of that place. Mm -hmm. It goes down to Jesse's house. Now he takes a look at everybody at Jesse's house. Jesse has seven sons. And this is going to be my end. Let's say seven sons. First son look good. Mm -hmm. Certainly is him. No, that ain't him. Look at the next son. That's him. No, that ain't him. Next son. No, that ain't him. That ain't, that ain't him. He asked the question, do you have another son? Yes, I have another son, but he's out in the field. God has told me, show me, this next anointing that God is giving to you, you're going to have to come from the field. Okay. Come on, Bishop. Bring it. To get to that next anointing. My yeah. God, my God. Okay, yeah. Come on, Bishop. Do I need to explain that one? No. Yeah. No. Talk, Bishop. You're not going to be in the house because the ones that are in the house, they have the look. Uh -oh. They have the image. They have the build. But they're not the one. They're not the one. Come on, Bishop. But the one that's in the field, oh, da 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 that has been obedient to his father. Mm -hmm. That did not come running in when he saw all the records going on. Right. Because his father said, stay in the field and tend to my sheep. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! God, I thank you, God. Come on, Bishop. He says, the next anointing that you get, oh, God, I want to, Shabbat. says, the next anointing that you get, you're going to have to come out of the field to get to this next anointing. Remain there, work steadfast. Do what I have assigned for you to do. Yes, Lord. All right. But there's a next anointing that has come. Thank you, Jesus. Where people have rejected you, right. now they have to call you king. But the oil didn't flow under the bowl, oh until I came in the presence of oh. yes. Holy Ghost. That's good time, Bishop. That's an oil that's coming that is a sign for each and every one of our lives. Not just for you. The oil is just not for you. Yes, yes, yes. Don't be conceited of the yes. gifting of God. Yes. My Lord, my Lord. Yes. That's why I do, ah, some people I see, they become so boastful and so, ah, you would not be anything if it wasn't for God. That's it, that's it. Come on, Bishop. Don't be nothing. I tell people all the time, hey, if y'all get terms without this microphone in his hand and God being on our side, he will be nothing. Man. All right. He will be absolutely nothing. Nothing. I'm on this. They, tell, they can tell you, I ran from this for a long time. <laughs> I was like, no, 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 no. no. Y'all don't understand. No. I ran from this for a long time. Because I saw all my inadequacies. I saw all of that. I was a person, I can't talk. I can't say those words like I need to. But God says I can trust you. Okay. Oh, God. Uh, he said all you have to do is open your mouth and ask me for it. Oh, God, I thank you, Lord God. All you have to do is just open your mouth. Yes. May not 
you know, break it down the way everybody else breaks it okay, down. Okay, come on now. He said, all you have to do is just open your mouth. Open your mouth, yes. Bishop. Let on. my anointing, let my yes. glory shine in your life. Right, right. Ah, it's no, no impurities. It's, it's nothing that you're adding on to it because you sold it. Trust me. All right, all right. right. You're taking your trust out of yourself now. Now you trust me now. Right, right, right. So I can have thy own way. Yeah. Oh, God, I thank you, Lord. Yes. Yes. That's good. We bless God. Yes. 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 Didn't have no title, no anything today, but God himself says that the next anointing that you're about to receive, All right. he's calling you out of the field. Yes. Wow. Wow. <laughs> You've been working. You've been doing everything that you could possibly do. People have overlooked you for so long, for yes. so many years. Because of one disobedience, My now God. you become king. All right, all right. Yes. Because of one disobedience, mm -hmm. you now become king. Thank you, Lord. Oh, God, I thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Because Vashti didn't want to show herself. Oh, God. That's right. Hi, God. Now I have to find me a new queen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. God just said, just come to me. God. Just come on. There's a call Thank you, that is going out in the land. Thank you, Lord. Just say, come. come. There's a people that he's now anointing for at such a time as this. Yes. My God. Yes. My God. There's a shifting that's going on in the land. Yes. I've come to a place really trying to get some clarity and understanding what's going on. Church is not based on my traditional form. Right. And you hear me, I say my traditional form. Right. God is not saying that I'm not moving, but there's a move in a different way. That's it. Even in that different way, that's still the same basis of the same foundation of that movement. But I'm moving in a different way that you may see over here a rhetoric or theatrics, but you see over here calmness and peace. Right, right. You may see over here that the shouting, the dancing, but you see over here Stillness yes. my God. and understanding. Yes, yes. Because my thoughts of how I grew up, I was drawn to the theatrics and the, the shout and the music. But now the movement has come to a stillness uh, right, right. and a peace. Yeah. Because now, out of that, I didn't get a full understanding. Of it. Okay, okay. I was talking to my wife and I'm close. I, I keep saying that. <laughs> you all right, you good, talk, Bishop. You all talk, right. Talk, talking to my wife. And we were talking about some of the old saints. I said, people don't understand what kind of church that we had. Mm -hmm. I said, talking about a Puerto Madrid. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Only one person know about a Puerto Madrid. <laughs> Port of Madrid was a place in Birmingham, Alabama, the church of Alabama, that you could hear before you get to it. Okay. Y'all, you said okay. okay. <laughs> we came out of church that was, you know, you had full band in the church. Full band. But we transitioned to this new ministry. But in this new ministry, they did something radical. So you will hear the church before you even get to it. Mm -hmm. So as soon as you get off the expressway and get down the street, you can hear the bump down the street. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, you will have big old speakers that you feel. <laughs> See? <laughs> you, you will have big old speakers that if you sat close to them, that you would be basically deaf by time. <laughs> <laughs> Lord have mercy. So, 
that era, it attracted us. So when we got to our church right here in Jonesboro, we had big old speakers in the church. Bumping. People coming. And we had small, it was a little bit bigger than this one. People come and walk by the speakers. Can't hear nothing. <laughs> because we were attracted to the sound. We were attracted to the music. But ask me any message that I heard during that time. No. <laughs> you heard the peep. Yeah, the, 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 the microphones were loud as they could be, music loud as it could be. So yeah, it's not to a place that I didn't hear what they were talking about. So it was to a place that I was attracted to the wrong sound. All right, all right. Come on, Bishop. And that particular time, hey, I was a little bit smaller, and y'all could beat me shouting. <laughs> <laughs> you know, hey, hey, I was a professional shouter. All right, you know, come on, Bishop. <laughs> I took I took my moment, you know, while the word was going on. I'm in the sound room, because I was a sound tech at that time. I was in the sound room, but when the praise came through that, <laughs> hey, you could beat me. <laughs> That's what I knew. I, 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 if I didn't know nothing else, I didn't know nothing else. I knew how to give God praise. Yeah. Okay. But I heard no word. My God. Oh my God. I was shouting based on what everybody else was doing. Yeah. I was shouting because the music was getting, you know, you know. Yeah. <laughs> it was getting good to me. But that didn't stop me from leaving out of that church <laughs> and doing some of the stuff that I did the same day. Not a day later, the same day. All right, come on now. <laughs> that's substance that's needed. And I like this moment because we're getting the substance Amen. that God has called for our life. Amen. 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 Come on and celebrate God. <laughs> I hope that I talk good. I hope that I talk good. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. I just wanted to talk this morning. Amen. Um, because it is a place that's very imperative that we understand our anointing. Our anointing. We understand that there's a lot of gifted people out there, but there's no anointing. Amen. There's no anointing. There's no anointing. And uh, uh, you know, I don't want to be the person who bash. But we raised up a people that we celebrate gifting before the anointing. Right, right. that's true. Right. You know, uh, as the apostle says so many times, we had mothers and deacons inside of the church that had no vocal ability. But it was just something about their sound. They right. began to see mm -hmm. that change atmosphere. Yes. That was the anointing. Yes, yes. God. Mm -hmm. You didn't have the Bishop C. White who would just sing a song and big people began to weep. Had no vocal ability. Right. But it was just something about pop singing and, right. and, and, and the squall he had. Yes. It was the anointing. The anointing. It was nothing like Apostle Bailey singing songs and and getting down to our runs and things and, and twirling around, twirling around. It was nothing like that. It was the anointing. That's what I miss. Uh, uh, where leaders can just simply lift their hands. So right, 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 right. And change atmosphere. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Now I lift my hands, you look at me like I'm crazy. The anointing that destroys it. Yes, yes, yes. We can articulate, we can we can exegete, we can come with theology, we can come with all of that. But if I don't have a, the anointing of God, mm, yes. the kingdom influence that is needed to change your lives. I'm just talking. A influencer is what people do on TikTok and YouTube. Mm -hmm. Because I dress a certain way, I look a certain way, now I'm influencing.
influence you, huh, maybe I can try that for you. Right. Sometimes you try certain stuff, it just don't work for you. That's true. Mm -hmm. But in this influence, if you try God, mm -hmm. Mm, everything, I don't care what it is, everything will work out for you. Yes, it will. Hallelujah. 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 We bless God. Amen. We thank God. Amen. For God Himself just yeah. being prevalent in our lives. Yes. We thank Him for the manifestation yeah. of what He's getting ready to do. I thank God for the scratch. And I thank Him for pressing us back together. Yes. 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 I thank Him with the mindset that He's going to do what He said He's going to do. Yes. Oh God, I may not understand what is going on right now. But I know that he's working it out in yes. our favor. Yes, Lord. And I speak that out to everybody, everybody here. It may not look the way that you feel that it should look right, right now. Amen. Right. Yeah. I know that. I know that. You know, we want it instantaneously, but he yes. says, I'm still working it out. Thank God. You. That's favor that is still resting and ruling over your life. Mm -hmm. Don't let nothing challenge you. That God is not, that God is not going to do it for you. All right, amen. Don't let nothing challenge. Yes. That God is not going to do it for you. Yes. Don't let me, anybody else, mother, sister, brother, whoever. Don't let nothing challenge. God is not going to do something That's special just for you. Because they need for you, you to get that special thing from God. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. They need for you to be in a good place. They need for you to be in a happy place. Mm, yes. But as long as they challenge that he's not going to do it, you're not going to get to the place that you need to be. Mm -hmm. So let nothing separate you yes. from the love of God. Amen. Let nothing separate you from the love of God. He's gonna do it. Yes, he's gonna do it. 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 So at this time, we're gonna go ahead and get our tithes and offering out of the way. Amen. If anybody's out there, amen. If you'd like to sow, amen. You can sow into Cash App, uh, Apal South, amen. Into the talking today, amen. If you're in Rome, you can sow into Apal South. Dollar sign, PayPal, solve it, cash out, amen. Zill, uh, PayPal, everything is available, amen. I hope that you were blessed by these wonderful words, amen. We thank God for uh, Apostle and uh, the shallow uh, teaching that he had on yesterday. Amen. Amen. It was wonderful, it was great, it was wonderful, amen. We do want to ask if you can, if you can go back to his page, amen, and share, amen, that wonderful teaching. Yes. Amen. It still is available uh, online on Facebook that you can share it, amen, with other people, amen. Great teaching, great lesson, amen, with him and Dr. Hackford. Um, we are gearing ourselves, amen, for conference that's going to be there in October, going into November, amen. More information, it will be coming out shortly about that time of gathering. Amen. If you can, if you will, amen. We're going to ask everybody, if you can, amen, just meet us there. Hey, meet us there. It's going to be a wonderful time, amen, in that city during that time frame, amen. Uh, we ask every man, every person, if you can, make sure that you uh, uh, give your shallow dues, amen, which is $20. If you have not done it already, amen, we ask that $20 will be submitted to the cash app, the uh, dollar sign shallow ministerial is it an alliance or is it just shallow ministerial? Yeah, shallow ministerial. So if when you have it, when you get it, hey, you know, sometimes it's like my kids might be burning their hand. So <laughs> as soon as you get that twenty dollars in your hand, <laughs> go, go, man, you know, the twenty dollars, hey man, it's like, hey, I can go give me some Roblox uh Roblox cards and all this stuff. It's like look. Come on now, but yeah, as soon as you get that $20, amen, you can just send it right over so that everything can be solidified and taken care of for that time frame, amen. 
Uh, I know that we have uh, the conversation about the t-shirts. Amen. We're going to start working on that as quickly as possible. Uh, we don't want to wait till the end uh, to get that done because it's going to be a lot of t-shirts that needs to be made. And I know everybody has their own size and their own colors and everything else <laughs> that, they want, <laughs> that they want. Amen. So we're going to go ahead and try to take care of that as quickly as possible because I know certain people may want multiple shows. So we're going to get that taken care of as quickly as possible uh, so that we know exactly how many we need. Um, but if it's nothing else, amen, we're going to ask everybody uh, to stand. Um, be blessed, Facebook. Be blessed until we meet again. Amen.